hello welcome to my channel my name is alicia i cannot believe it's almost november um this is like the weekend before halloween um mainly because it's 77 in california and i'm seeing palm trees anywho <clears throat> being a med midwest gal that like has i i don't know i feel like my circadian rhythm has always been off in the fall um it just never feels like fall and it especially never feels like winter i think just because of the temperature Anywho, so when I woke up this morning, my goal was to go to the mall and see what we can find, pants, see if there's like any tops, mainly pants, but um, once a pull kind of sucked me in with a $5 styling fee and they do a preview now and this time the preview was lovely. I picked like four or five things, four pairs of jeans, two tops, and then I guess that means I'll get two surprises or one surprise. I don't even know. So because of that, I don't really think I need to go to the mall and buy pants. I really should wait and see if the wantable ones, because I think three or four of them are Liverpool. Um, so I really don't need to do that, but I may, we may still end up there. So I'm sitting out of sight of Marshall's right now. Um, so I don't know what the day's going to take is. Originally, prior to really wanting pants, the Stitch Fix pants didn't work. Um, I wanted to go to Target and see if I could make an outfit out of Target. And I think the answer is really no. I don't know how, I would be interested for those of you like, I don't know, in the Midwest or a smaller town, how is your Target? Because when I grew up in Indiana, um, we had one Target near us. Any other Target was like a 30, 40 minute drive. And it seemed like a bigger thing. They had a lot more selection. And I have three Targets, give or take, within an area from me and they vastly differ in the amount of clothes they have. And I feel like the amount of clothes they have has shrunk over time, and some of them are even tiny, but the style of clothes doesn't appeal to me anymore. Like, it seems, I don't know whether it's a younger crowd, a trendier crowd, I don't know. So I don't know where the day's gonna take us. Um, I am hosting our staff Christmas party here at about, I don't know, five weeks. So I went to, Goodwill. I, I went to Pinterest. I was looking at centerpieces. I need affordable centerpieces. And there was one where they had vases filled with Christmas, like, you know, like green and red Christmas ornaments. And so I got like, I think seven, somewhere five, six, seven vases um, at Goodwill. And so I need to go to Walmart and see, I need to see which is cheaper, Walmart or Amazon to get Christmas ornaments to fill them, uh, ribbon, what have you. But I'm outside Marshalls just to see what they have for Christmas because I, at least in California, like if you want Halloween at Marshalls or TJ Maxx, you better go in like August because it just sells out. So I kind of want to see what they have. If there's anything really cute I can't live without. I will peruse their clothes and skincare, but honestly, here lately, I have not had much luck with the skincare stuff at TJ Maxx really at all. And then Marshalls um, somewhat. And Marshalls, I was having really great luck with their plus size but the last time I looked at their extra large section it seems more like juniors or like a smaller extra large sort of section um so I don't know where the day's gonna take us we will see what we get but I guess we're gonna do a little shopping together anywho I'll be back all right, Marshalls did pretty good. And I have video clips of me trying on a couple things and of their Christmas stuff. So I did say yes to a Christmas tree. Um, I think it was $14.99. I will say, I feel like their stuff is getting more expensive, but I think I needed this. I couldn't say no. I really like it. It's kind of like a velvety feel. Last year I got like a few Christmas trees. I'm kind of like maybe trying like every year to add a couple Christmas trees. This is really big, but kind of almost like a little Christmas tree area. And again, this one might be too big, but I had to say yes. There was another little like planter box that said joy on it that I really liked. I think this coming week when my husband puts away Halloween, I think he's gonna have to get down Christmas because I just really don't know what I have or what I need, but I liked this guy. And I had a couple almost, there was two plaid things I really liked. One really liked it and the large probably would have been okay, but I think in the arms and such, I really wanted an extra large. I did pick up a pair of jeans, which again, you'll see the try on after, but democracy jeans, 
My only complaint is that they're light wash and I really, at this point, don't, light wash is not my preferred. I, I think mainly because it's, it's more casual looking in my opinion, but these were $34, size 14. Um, and I will say when I get Democracy in boxes, they don't seem to fit as well. And so I wonder if Marshall's has like older ones. I don't know, but these seem to fit really good. Um, I really didn't have any complaints. Um, and so those, those are staying tags on until I get my wantable and just see. Um, but these for the price could even be him to make shorts or like capris or something. So for the price, these may have to stay. I just, I would rather them be a darker wash. So I am going, I think I'm going to go to Target next. So we will see if I get anything out of that or not. Otherwise you guys will see my try on and clips from Marshall's. All right, I did not make it to Target, but just in case we were wondering, these are definitely cheaper at Walmart than Amazon. And so I guess it's because maybe Christmas trees are green. I really wanted to get one box of all red and one box of all green. Green was not in a plentiful thing. So I don't know, I may, don't know if I made the right choice. I got one with red, white, and silver. And then I got one with red and green. And I have no idea whether this is going to be enough not enough um i have varying sizes of bases so i feel like two is plenty but i have no idea so <clears throat> that's what i end up getting these are like six bucks a piece for 40 30 i don't see it now anyway 40 or 30 ornaments for one reason this doesn't have it oh this one does oh 26 i was wrong on all fronts anyway <clears throat> up next will be my try-ons and stuff at marshall's anyway have a great day and i will talk to you soon my problem is I have no idea what I have or don't have. I love this joy arrangement. It's only 16 bucks, so it may come home with me. And for whatever reason, I really love this tree. It may come home with me too. I really need my husband to get down all of our Christmas stuff because I don't know what we have and don't have. Last year, I got really cheap holiday pillowcases on Amazon and I've taken now to having like a holiday uh, throw. I don't remember whether I got one for Christmas last year or not. This is one of those shocking pieces. Um, I don't even know what brand it is. I really just didn't think it would work. It is a size large. I do think I would rather have an extra large, but I did not have one. And I don't know, I think this is cute. I picked it up just almost for like a jacket type thing. Now that I need a jacket, we also have a plaid day at work. Um, and I absolutely cannot button it. But I just think this is kind of cute. Um, reminds me of my dad. He always had a flannel. Again, I really do think an extra large would be better. It's just 25 bucks and I don't, I mean, I think that's a fair price. This feels really nice quality, really soft. Um, I wish they had an extra large because I kind of really like it. All right, this is the top from the loft. It's on clearance for 16. I don't understand the neck because like it, so it could button, but then it would be super tight and I'm not a fan of that. Um, I do like the button detail. Um, it's fine. I mean, for 16 bucks, it's really a, a steal, but I don't feel super good in it. Um, again, I think if I live maybe somewhere colder, this might be an easy pickup, but not really a fan of the neck, but it's a good price. All right, I have on a pair of Democracy that fit pretty good. They're only $34. Um, they do have this stretchy band. I kind of, I mean, I think at the moment they actually fit pretty good. And I just had lunch. I will say, I think, <coughs> I feel like in a lot of pants here lately, I do have a little bit of a love handle thing. Um, I don't really need another pair of light wash, but they really do fit pretty darn good. All right, I was starting to cough, so I paused. I don't know, these may have to be a yes. I feel like for 34 bucks, democracy, um, even if I got them him to make shorts since I'm having issues with sh finding shorts in the winter, um, I like these. So I may have to take them home with me, wear them around the house, see how they do, um, but they feel way better than the Stitch Fix ones last night and they are a fabulous price. I really like this lucky kind of like, plaid jacket it's 30 bucks it fits great it would be great for like indiana and times around here 
sadly it's just not in a good or good color pattern for me otherwise this is very very tempting